occupied. The insult of it. It's more than insulting. It's salt in the wound. I could have daggers in a hundred necks by nightfall. No doubt. But more necks would present themselves tomorrow. I have other daggers. Am I interrupting? Forgive Thea. She gets testy when a contract is delayed. Neither of you strike me as the bloodthirsty sort. Our shared enemies deserve our worst. You want help against the gods. We want Treviso free. We now think they may be the same problem. The occupation has a face. The Antam commander, Keith Lord Butcher Dathrata. But Viago thinks killing him outright is short-sighted. The Butcher took the city suspiciously fast. Removing him is useless if someone else can repeat that. With the help of gods or something else. Despite it being the outcome, assassination is not about killing, it's about sending a message. And what message would that be? The crows rule Antiva, and Treviso will be free. Sounds like you think the occupation wasn't just about force. Cruel as the Butcher is, he didn't break the city with a siege. It was sudden and complete. Like he had it all mapped. Where to march and what to close off to choke resistance. He had inside information? Spies? He had something. And until we know what it was, killing him isn't the contract. Butcher Death Rada. What do you know about him? The Antam army fractured, split among warlords, and he seems to have kept the most traditional discipline. And the rank and file like it. His numbers keep growing, but the Butcher himself is... odd. Odd how? He gives daily speeches about how the occupation is somehow merciful. And the way he talks, it's... familiar. It's like he thinks he belongs here. And I won't have it. You're in charge? Antiva has a king. And the power of a king is enforced by armies. Antiva has no army. It has the crows. There's a reason Antivan coins have portraits of guild leaders, not royalty. We're patriots. Crows can't field a battalion, but we protect our nation our way. The gods care about taking Treviso? The Butcher wants Treviso. The gods may just want the Antam. But Antam distrust magic and outright fear demons. They should be enemies. Power can turn anyone against their own interests. Their own people. Helping the crows helps everyone in the long run. What's the first step to your message? We have a scout named Darith. He said he was onto something the Butcher was hiding. He was in the Drown District, so that's a place to start. Find our crow and help with his contract. Find your crow? Then what? We break this occupation. We craft the message one step at a time. And when we finally assassinate the person who leashed Treviso, that death will tell everyone. The crows rule Antiva, and Treviso will be free. I've noted the location of Dareth and his cousin. Jakobus, in the Drown District. They're always together. Jakobus will be eager to help. Perhaps too eager for one so young. Can you blame him? We've all lost too much to this occupation. Like Antam blood. I'll keep the goods flowing.
Safe travels. in the lullaby that I think started as Dwarven and then became Bad Elven. Oh, go on. Irsana and Ma. In Elven, it could mean I'm filled with nothing. But what if it's actually Isana? The Dwarven word for Lyrium? Isn't Lyrium Titan blood? The next line's about the Elven gods. Your Lyrium brings pride to the gods. They did use Lyrium, we know that much. Wow. Is this difficult for you? I don't have to keep going. No, oh, keep going. I'm invested now. A fine evening, is it not, my friends? Oh. I'm glad the market's still open during occupation. It probably helps to feel that some things are still the same. So many things you could buy. How do you choose? on the best group stand in Treviso. That's just fine. Take a look if you like.
Thanks. Welcome. Whether you're looking for functional blades or authorized display replicas, you're in the right place. We just got a pair of woodcut replicas of Belladonna daggers from Hart in Hideout. Cafe lighter? Hmm, good night for it. Welcome to the Dapa Duelist. While magic is outlawed under the anthem, we have some excellent casting leather for display purposes. Welcome. Please, have a look. Oh, you have a keen eye.
Stopped me on my way to work. Demanded to know who I was and where I was going. There's the place. Keep your eyes open. You may not be the only ones interested.
So this is Treviso now. Have some hope. The crows haven't given up. They won't last much longer if the army... Done. Are you Jacobus? Dareth, my cousin. They. Please, you have to finish Dareth's contract. It's about the butcher. My cousin was going to spy on the butcher. He told me we'd pick up the contract from a dead drop. But then. Someone has to finish this for Dareth. Please. We will. You should get back to the diamond. I will, just. Just give me a minute. We should see if... That note said Dareth should pick up the contract at the usual place across from Taya and Viago. Just follow the marks. Maybe a mark one crow would leave for another? I spotted something on the walls. Earlier, I mean. Let's go look. That looks like a crow mark. A kind of quick splatter you can throw? That's gotta be Dareth's trail. Keep an eye out. Wow! Even during an occupation... Another mark this way.
Here's another crow mark.
Do a lot of elven ruins float like that? I've never seen anything like it. And I've been all around Thetis several times. Not until recently, Solus changed something with this ritual. I know an elf who camped in some ruins, woke up and found that they'd ended up in the clouds. How did they get down? Oh, they have it. Too far up, but we send them food and water. Ah, thank you for that new nightmare. next crow mark. This is where the marks lead. Dareth's contract must be here somewhere. The Butcher is making poison. Comic. The poison that destroys your mind? That comic? If I were the Butcher, it'd be a good way to keep people in line. The Antom brought in a comic master to mix the poison. He's at the garrison. We stop him there, before this goes any further. Almost there. 
was not expecting to see Morrigan with the Veil Jumpers. She shows up now and again, sometimes with news or a warning. That sounds like Morrigan. Some of the others swear she watches out for us in the form of a raven. And she once swooped down to save a couple of Veil Jumpers from a rampaging demon. Oh. She once swooped down to save a couple of veil jumpers from a rampaging demon. As a spider, a really large one, wagon sized. Well, I'd rather have the wagon sized spider on my side, I suppose. We're in. Let's find the Comic Master.
dead. Thank goodness. Hate those things. First things first. Let's destroy the rest of the poison. Then we figure out what was going on here. <laughs> That's the last of the poison, thankfully. Let's look for anything else that explains what's happening. Wait, this note says that wasn't all the comic. The Butcher's angry because some went missing. Who else would want comic? No idea, but the note does mention the Butcher's inside traitor. The occupation had help. Taya and Viago need to know they were right. You out of your minds? So I told you crows to stay out of this. Out of what? Defending our home? If we had a stronger civil government instead of a bunch of circus criminals, the Antom wouldn't have a foothold in the first place. Who is this? This is Governor Ivenchi. They have concerns. My concern is how you've endangered the city. We're defending Antiva. These protections are in place for the good of everyone. You act without oversight. We crows are the oversight. 
And yet, here we are, awash in on, Tom. And now, you've angered the Butcher. We have other enemies, too. The gods are involved, corrupting some Ontom, making them monsters. And the Butcher? You two were right. He had help taking the city. Human traitors. I didn't want to believe it. Killing the Butcher does nothing if someone could just sell us out again. I'd start right here. You Talons are known for infighting and betrayal. You're accusing them? One of their crows died for this contract. That's enough. Rook, thank you for finishing that contract. The only reward we have is to ask you for more. We're allies. Of course I'll help. Ivenchi is right about one thing. The Butcher will not like that we're fighting back. We need to be ready. Rook, I will have every crow tracking this traitor and the gods, and we will send word when we find something. The stakes are too high. This should be left to proper officials. Go back to filing trade receipts, Ivenchi. The crows rule Antiva. And Treviso will be free. With or without you, Governor. Always eager for your business. See you again. <laughs> 